I can wait that long. As long as I have reason to hope. Oh, I... I think you have every reason to hope. So Gentleman Jack has been cancelled, but uh, the L word Generation Q is, uh, it's still going. What a world we live in. What a world. If you see my hair moving about in this video, please just ignore it. It has a life of its own, a mind of its own. Okay. Yeah, I am surprised that they cancelled the show because it's a very, very well-made show. And I'm not just saying that because I'm, you know, a Saran Jones simp and clearly biased. Yeah, it's not like that. The show is genuinely a very good show. It's well-written, the acting is incredible, the costume, the design. It's interesting, it's fresh, and it's just an incredibly well-made show. Like, it really is. Every aspect of this show is kind of airtight. The writing, the acting, the costumes. 99.9% .9 of the storylines are also very good. I mean, maybe there's like the occasional storyline, which, yeah, the, the, the pig farmers. Also for a period drama, it's incredibly fresh and interesting. And it's fun to watch. Like, I don't feel like you need to be a lesbian. In fact, I'm sure the show has a huge viewership and I know it's not millions of lesbians because lesbians are quite a small minority. So the show does have a very kind of broad appeal. And not only not only does the show have a kind of broad appeal, it has a huge dedicated fan base. I mean, I told you guys when I was in Halifax uh, for the season two premiere, I met people who had kind of flown over from America just to kind of be at this premiere. So it's had such a huge impact on its audience. So I am surprised that they've canceled it. I think it's odd that they would cancel a show of such high quality. But then again, I don't know what the ratings were like. And I did notice that the promotion wasn't as strong as it was with the first season. So I think the pandemic possibly affected a lot of things. And of course, there was a lot of time between season one and season two. So uh, yeah, it's just difficult to say, you know, and yeah, I guess I just feel like it was cancelled a season too soon. I don't think a show like Gentleman Jack can go on for five seasons, if I'm honest, but it can certainly go on for three. I feel like that would have rounded the show off perfectly. It just feels a bit premature, you know, I wasn't quite ready to say goodbye goodbye to it and it didn't feel like it was done. I feel like there was one more season there for sure. I would absolutely take a third season on a different network. I mean there, there is a possibility we may get a third season so I don't really want to sit here and kind of give my overall thoughts on the show. I may do a comparison of season one and season two, I think that could be fun but I don't want to kind of sit here and give my overall thoughts just in case it's not over. The thing is I could sit here speculating about why it was cancelled but I really don't have the facts. I don't know what went on behind the scenes. I don't know what kind of discussions they were having. There's ratings, there's budget, there's all kinds of things uh, which go into these decisions and I'm just not in the know so I can only really speculate but I definitely did notice the lack of promotion but again is is that a budget thing was that to do with the pandemic like it, it's just it's we're living in weird times you know and it really sucks that it's been cancelled but I'm not really sure whether to kind of start mourning it because it's I don't know it just it feels like things are a bit up in the air I, I don't know what I will say is if it has been cancelled for good and, and we don't ever get another season um, of Gentleman Jack, I think season two ended in a perfect place. It's one of the few lesbian shows to kind of, to end on a positive note, to end on a happy ending. And what I really loved about season two is how Anne kind of summarized their whole relationship in that ending, you know, where she says, we are the only two people in the world who want us to be together and we're still here. And I just, that was such a perfect way to end season two. And in some ways it's a perfect way to end the show. So I think if nothing else, we have that, you know, and, that's the silver lining, I guess. If Gentleman Jack as we know it is over and if the show is cancelled for good, I just want to say a huge thank you to the cast 
to the crew who made this show possible. I mean, it is such an incredible show and, you know, Sally has really brought back a piece of women's history, a piece of lesbian history that was largely in the shadows. She has brought that to the forefront and it's phenomenal. The show is refreshing in its portrayal of lesbians, in its portrayal of women. It's wow, you know, I, it, what a gift. <sighs> so a huge thank you to Sally, a huge thank you to the cast, to the crew who worked on this show. You know, the amount of hard work that goes into creating a show like this. It really paid off. God, and Sophie and Saran really brought that relationship to life. They did. I mean, their chemistry is just insane. Ho oh, ho, that chemistry. That chemistry was, was great. Not just their chemistry, but their acting. The way that they kind of fleshed out these roles and the way they kind of interacted with each other. I mean, you can tell both of them put 110% into those roles. And it just, what, just wow. We we were blessed. We were blessed. We really were. And and Gemma was hilarious. I mean, just there wasn't one weak link in the cast. And if that's the end, I'm I'm sad. I'm I'm heartbroken. It's just brought me so much joy. And I think it's a really important piece of television. So thank you to the BBC and to HBO for what they have given us. And if we do get another season to say goodbye, that would be incredible. But if we don't, I am definitely grateful for what they have given us. And Saran, if you're watching this, I just just, I'm in love with you. I have always been in love with you. I know we're never gonna happen, but I won't give up hope. I mean it respectfully. I just respect you and I adore you and that's, that's the end of it. Okay. Okay guys, let me know your thoughts on this cancellation. How are you feeling? Do you think we're gonna get another season or is it done? Do you think it's done? I, I don't know. I'm interested to know what you guys think. So let me know in the comments section. Please do. If you're a lesbian, if you're a woman who likes Gentleman Jack, come and join the Sapphic Underground Club. Just come and join it. It's home for lesbians. It's home for lesbians who are just lost in the great wide world. Just come home. We miss you. No, that is weird. It's weird. Okay, goodbye. <laughs>